I really think they should get rid of Rube Goldberg Project because I feel like you really don't learn that much about physics and it's also such a hassle to build and it takes so many hours when you could really learn a lot more about physics through other things. No, or at least not in the way that it was given to us last year. Um, while it was interesting and at some points fun, we didn't really learn anything from it. Like there was an application of physics, but you know you can kind of imagine that in your own head. I also think that if it was to be kept, that um, it might be useful to do it in the classroom and you could learn more from that. And the teacher could really see how much work it does take to complete the project. Like I thought it was a good project, but I didn't really learn much. So I think they should get rid of it because it's not worth it. like it, it takes like a lot of time and effort, and it's not worth it. It's like 100 points. It doesn't really do anything for your grade. If they keep it, I think it should be more of like a final project instead of just like a regular project during the year. Uh, I'd like to do the Rube Goldberg because it would be interesting to try and figure out how to make something really simple happen in really complicated steps. Uh, I think it should be kept because I actually thought it was really interesting and I got to apply physics, which is something you don't really get to do that often. So Rube Goldberg took about like three weekends up of your time to do, it took forever, and then everybody ended up getting about the same grade on the project and just memorizing what you needed to say in front of your teachers, so it didn't really teach us anything, so I don't really think that they should keep it in the system, in the curriculum, because overall it didn't really affect our learning at all. They don't tell you at all how to do it, and so you just spend hours trying to do something which you don't understand, and it was just a waste, I didn't learn anything. Um, I remember helping out my sisters who did it like a few years ago and it was kind of annoying I guess. It was just like took a lot of time and like doing, I don't know, I think you could do a lot more projects in that time that are a little more fun. And uh, yes, definitely get rid of the Rube Goldberg project because it doesn't accurately uh, assess a student's <laughs> uh, grasp of physical concepts. And uh, for example, my junior year, I dropped a whole letter grade in my physics class because our Rube Goldberg machine didn't work that day and that was just a building flaw, it wasn't a, a knowledge flaw. I found that, uh, you know, searching our house for just stuff that we could use to build like Legos and things, I, I just thought that was really fun. It's, it's like just not fair because a lot of parents usually do the project as we're here and like because there's these engineers from Stanford that are parents they end up doing the project for their kids and it's just it's unfair on an education level. Yeah.